you know, again, compare the, 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 the meerkat, you know, compare that to how people like Confused Ocom are just scrabbling around, constantly trying to find, reinvent themselves to try and find some traction, you know. And you think they're finding that difficult because the, uh, the distinctiveness and the, you know, the, the, the cultural ascendancy, if you will, of the, of the meerkat um, creative strategy just makes it very difficult for the others to um, take a different route and to distinguish themselves creatively. Is that your view? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's hard to make to, to, to make a stamp, especially when you you know you've got Go Compare as well, you know, which are you know universally derided. But you know, we all know their <laughs> we all know their name. <laughs> you, you know, I mean, they are the equivalent of the the Ferrero Rocher ads of the. Of, yeah, of, I, I I think that's interesting because the um the money supermarket. I mean, who's that guy that was you know Channel Four kind of comedian that's got the yeah big, Nick, Nick Berry yeah um yeah Nick Berry um. I, I, you get the idea that they're trying to, um, oh, what would be the most appropriate word? Um, you know, they're trying to be more surreal um, than um, even the, the meerkat approach, but I'm not entirely sure they fully understood that. There seems something derivative about that approach, which is trying to um, uh, compete against meerkat, but it's meerkat isn't competing because it's, you know, it, it's funny, it's warm, it's accessible, and it's popular. And yeah. that isn't the money supermarket approach. Um, and there's more of a, you know, a, a wry knowing um, kind of um, hipster surrealism um, shtick going on there. And I'm, I'll, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be surprised if it works as well. That's my, my yeah. Point. And, and look, I, I think compare the supermarket, the money market are hands down for the last ten years done creatively much better ads <laughs> do you know what I mean they they you know I I, I did some when they were at uh, Miles Crawcroft we did some freelance for them um, and they were really funny you know they were really funny scripts and the stuff that went out was really funny um, they lost it and it went to mother and mother did um, those really lovely ads you know the guy with the huge backs backsides the dancing ones you, you, you know the the, the they were culturally you know, went, but for some reason, they just haven't made an impression. But they're better ads. But overall, they just haven't done as well. You know, and I, I, I can't explain that. <laughs> you know, I wish I could. 